Now at 5 o'clock, a subsidiary of Evraz North America, the owners of the steel mills in Pueblo, claims a construction company is failing to do the $300 million job they were hired to do. Investigative reporter Dan Beatty spoke with both sides, joins us with more on what's next. Dan. Wanzak Construction was hired on to build the brand new state-of-the-art rail mill right here in Pueblo, but now this federal lawsuit filed by a subsidiary, subsidiary excuse me, of Evraz North America alleges or claims that the construction company is costing them tens of millions of dollars. In July of 2021, Everest North America, along with state and local politicians, broke ground on the new rail mill powered entirely by solar at Everest Rocky Mountain Steel in Pueblo. 800 jobs, good jobs, in the Pueblo community, modernizing the production of rail. Now a year and a half later, a subsidiary of Everest North America filed a federal breach of contract suit against Wanzek Construction from North Dakota alleging the construction company didn't complete contractually required work, failed to hire adequate workers, and caused property damage, which endangered personnel. The suit says they've lost approximately $130 million in damages because the project keeps getting delayed. A spokesperson for Wanzek Construction is vigorously denying the claims. Intel's 13 investigates they believe the lawsuit was filed in, quote, bad faith. Two days after the lawsuit was filed in federal court, Wanzik Construction filed a counterclaim. The counterclaim says Everest North America's subsidiary ordered extensive additional work outside the contract, never completed the design for the rail mill, and refuses to pay for increased costs. Everest North America declined to respond to the counterclaim, saying, while we can't comment on pending legal matters, we are committed to completing the new rail mill project in a safe, efficient, and timely manner. The project was scheduled to be finished in 2023, but according to that counterclaim, Wanzek uh, Construction believes it won't be finished until February of 2024 at the earliest. And on top of that, Wanzek Construction believes that the price of this project is going to has doubled from approximately $300 million to $600 million. Reporting live in Pueblo, Dan Beatty, 13 Investigates.